Hi there, uh, back here today testing again um, Norton Antivirus 2011 against um, McAfee Antivirus Plus. Um, the last test you have seen uh, um, the test when I was downloading some links and trying to access some files over the internet, but uh, this time I um, I'm using my malware files which uh, you have seen in my previous tests and uh, have them already downloaded to see how well the both products behave by detecting them um, here they are um, I will as usual start with uh, Norton, Norton antivirus uh, both products are updated to the latest uh, signatures so uh, let's start with Norton with the first file uh, you maybe have seen my video about Trend Micro which did catastrophically <laughs> in this case um, so you will see how Nort and, uh, Norton and uh, McAfee will do in this test case Okay, uh, already blocked auto protection blocked uh, threads. Um, suspicious pro processing. Yeah. Processing threads. Okay. And we do the same with the next file as well. Just to see what Norton has uh, completed processing threads. Uh, we have a lot of lists with threads. And um, yeah, okay, still blocking files. So we go into the first file. Here we have uh, some three malware remaining. If I will start this, see what's happening. That's interesting. Uh, it's got through, now it's blocked. Um, program behavior suspicious okay somehow I get anyway a uh, um, Windows firewall warning so uh, I will uh, unblock now to see maybe whether this malware will download more more files and go on with the next file and this was blocked by sonar and removed um, which is their behavior detecting behavior suspiciously okay so we'll continue with the next file it's also blocked Okay, so that's Norton. Now we we'll run the same files on uh, the machine with McAfee. Three minutes, it's there a cloud antivirus detection. This as well. That too. Which 
generic potential unwanted program blocked casino online remove um, security center you are about to remove programs that you may have instead as a bottle of sweet uh, please read the program as uh, let make every automatically remove the program okay so um, yes again this program yes so let's see here we have um, five five programs remaining we we'll see what's happening when we start those files um, that's gone Okay. We have a virus warning, Trojan. Uh, the next one. Okay, I will continue here now. of warnings here so somehow I don't know whether uh, here we have something going into the system uh, we will see okay ah now it's enough I don't want to see those warnings anymore okay so um, let's go into the na second folder Oh, here we still have. This is a fake antivirus, which goes <laughs> nice to be installed. Okay. Um, this is another file. This also. And uh, yeah. So we have some processes running on the Mac FE machine, as you see here at least those three are malware uh, comparing to uh, North, uh, Norton uh, I don't see any processes what I will do now is that I will restart both computers just to see what's remaining in memory when I have restarted it and we'll be back when uh, this is finished on both computers okay uh, back here Norton started up and um, I don't see so much suspicious here but the funny thing is here I'm trying to start McAfee again and it's not possible <laughs> it comes up and then it's closing down directly again so make every totally <laughs> how to say it's not possible to use it anymore and we can try somehow to get it in safe mode but um, in the meantime I will uh, make a scan with uh, Megabytes on the Norton machine and then with Hitman Pro and we'll be back when this is finished well back here um, I started with a quick scan at Norton and then Norton found nothing um, and uh, then I made the scan with Merobytes and it found two infect infected objects on the Norton machine it's a spyware password X generic um, so I'll remove those 
two and remaining infections. I uh, want to restart. No. Uh, now I will make a scan with um, Hitman Pro. And uh, about McAfee, I it was yeah, possible to start the computer in um, safe run mode. And I made a scan here with uh, McAfee and it found uh, one uh, infection. And uh, in win logon, spy agent generic. So uh, to fix this, I have to restart it. I will say restart later. And uh, I will start a scan with uh, Merobytes here to see what, what it finds and we will be back when this is finished. Well sorry, I just realized that I didn't look into this second malware folder and uh, on the Norton installation. So I was just running those um, two of those casino fake programs and uh, looks like Norton let that through. I wasn't getting any warnings from Norton and um, I will try to let this install finish and then make a second scan with uh, Norton and uh, Mavobytes on this machine because those malware was blocked by uh, McAfee but as you see it's it's running on the on the Norton machine okay okay uh, Norton quick scan finished zero threats found and the second scan with um, Merobytes found one additional thread uh, remove this and uh, probably it's one which hasn't removed at the first scan, I don't know. Anyway, um, running here now, soon out of time, so I will just make a scan with Hitman Pro on that machine. And um, in the meantime, about McAfee, um, <laughs> well, 37 infections. I mean, this is. Yeah, and this is a pay product. It looks the same <laughs> as um, Trend Micro. If you have seen the video, Trend Micro was really, really poor. <laughs> and uh, here we have McAfee. Uh, let a lot of malware go through, and uh, 30 s 37 infected room objects found with malware bytes. I even haven't started the scan with. Uh, Hitman Pro yet, so uh, 37. Uh, I don't want to restart now, so now I will try a scan with um, Hitman Pro here as well, and uh, we'll be back when both Hitman Pro scans are finished. Well, uh, scan finished on the Norton computer, and uh, we have. Um, six remaining or six seven MA remaining objects found by the cloud antivirus hitman pro and uh, back to the McAfee machine here we also have seven threats uh, remaining on the system um, after all this so uh, that's it I will just thank you <laughs> and uh, Hope to see you soon. Bye.